with just a little backdrop here. The crops have been off to a good start this season, but as the heat and the uh, drought has uh, worn on there, we're, we're really uh, testing out their ability to withstand the drought. Uh, we are irrigating all of our fruits and vegetables at the present time. In the background here, we do have the large gun uh, running on a field of sweet corn here. And uh, of course, the, the water is the essential missing element when we're in a drought. We have everything else that we've done possible to grow a good crop. And uh, when we're missing the rain, then we have to supplement with irrigation. I'm happy to say that we are able to, to uh, produce a very nice crop with irrigation, but it takes a lot of effort and a lot of water. One of the things that happens when we have uh, drought stress here, sometimes we have uh, wildlife that's very, very stressed as well. And we'll have uh, birds, for example, flocks of birds, large flocks of birds, thousands of birds coming in feeding on our crop and so I have to be constantly watching and listening to see if a flock would move in if we need to be ready to chase them out and keep them moving so that they're not uh, destroying the crop that we're looking to harvest the next day. That's particularly true in the fruit. It also is true in the sweet corn. In fact, as I came out here to start the gun, I chased a flock of birds at, at the corner of the field there. So that's always a challenge. But we. Uh, try to uh, do what we need to do to keep the crop intact and keep the birds where they belong. Say, so there's no rest for the weary until we get some rain.